excited to finally show you the Great Omunwa River. Oh my goodness! <laughs> We're almost there. Oh really? Mm. I am super duper excited. <laughs> you know, it's been my dream to see the Omunwa River the whole time. My father speaks so graciously about it. Well, here we are. Oh really? Before you right here is the Great Omunwa River. Oh. The ancient river of our people. Yes, I know. It's fascinating, isn't it? from me I, I I don't want to hurt you I, I just want to talk please Adeze why is she running from me why is she always running Plans to come to our kingdom on an official visit to see our daughter, Princess Oma, in three days' time. Hmm. Yes, I, I was informed by his father, the king, just this morning. I can't wait. Yes. Honestly, I can't wait to see our daughter, Princess Oma, become the queen of Umezema's kingdom. That would be the greatest blessing the gods have ever favored me with. Yes. I am happy for this great news. Yes. Yes. Mm. Yes. And uh, by the way, where is she? She's in no other place than her chamber. Yes. I need to see the pretty face of my daughter. I haven't this morning. It's all right. In that case, let me call one of the maids to go get her for you. Yes. Um, Aluchi! Where is this girl? Take it easy. Take it easy. Oh, please. Come in. Are you mad? Since when did we become roommates for you to ask someone to come into my room without my permission? What nonsense! Don't come in. Go outside. You're a bloody fool. Come back here. Eh? Come in. Will you 
move. Greetings, my princess. Yes, greetings. How may I help you? The king requests your presence. Oh, my father, the king. Tell him I'll be with him in a bit. Yes, my princess. Okay. Plotty fool. Nonsense. What was that? Oh, 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 what was that? I was trying to cut the something. Cut what? Huh? Cut what? Little witch, born of a big witch. Plotty fool. Do you have anybody as beautiful as me in your lineage? Oh, I forgot. I'm my cousin. Rubbish. Just go ahead. Go ahead! Continue! Oh, here comes... The prettiest smile. The prettiest, the fairest of ten thousand. Ah, shush. The star in my sky that shines ever so bright. <laughs> With an incandescent light glowing, glowing so bright. Ah. The only one worthy to bear the royal blood in her veins. <laughs> oh, my daughter. Oh my, my daughter. Now, now you want to make me cry. Oh, no. <laughs> Good morning, father. <sighs> Good morning, mother. Good morning, my princess. Thank you, mom. My angel. Oh, beautiful Naya. Oh, mama, Saro. I hope you slept well. Um, I slept beautifully well. I had a splendid night. I mean, I woke up feeling like a gorgeous princess. Yes, you <laughs> should, my dear. You see, your shining, dazzling, radiant face gladdens my heart. Oh, Papa. Ah, my dear. You are the source of my morning joy. Father. <laughs> Thank oh, you. yes. Thank you so much, Father. Thank you. Ah, my dear. <laughs> you see, the Prince of Mwezenazi Kingdom is slated to enter this kingdom for the first time in three days' time. <gasps> He is coming for the first time to behold your radiant face. His own bride. I think that the moment he enters, he enters this palace and beholds your dazzling, shining, pretty face. He's going to fall headlong in love mm. with you, my oh, father. dear. Father, dear. I can see it clearly. Oh. A clear picture yeah. of the prince oh. holding me. Father, yes. I am so eager oh, yes. to see him. Oh, yes. I can't wait. Oh, yes. I can see us. Okay. Hand in hand, okay. walking slowly, gliding, gliding, father, gliding, <laughs> gliding, yes, father, holding hands, oh, father. Oh. and gliding, ah. gliding, father, oh. and you glide, and you glide. This is total unusual. From princess to palace bedding on the Zimba You have taught her royal court Ibeya Wamebu A royal nile Onebe 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 Oh, 
So keep watching. My position is forcefully being taken away from me. My cousin now parades herself as, as the princess of our kingdom while I'm being made her, her servant. But that this is not fair. How long will you and mother watch? How long will you keep watching while everything you've ever worked for is being forcefully taken away from you? This was how they forcefully took away your throne and now they're taking everything away from me. Greetings. How are you? I'm fine, sir. Where is my brother? The thing is inside. I'm waiting the arrival of his new son, the two elders. Let me join them. He has to leave. He doesn't have to go the way of his brothers. Yes, he will leave. My dynasty has not come to an end yet. Hmm. Igwe, the great king of the land, the gods are with you. You have not wronged any spirit, nor mortals. You have not forcefully taken what does not belong to you. My king, you have not oppressed the poor, the widows, nor the fatherless. Therefore, the gods will not let you lose. my only brother. And as I greet you, fear of the unknown, anxiety, depression. They have beclouded me, as a creature. <sighs> Fear not, my brother. The light is here. As a creature has come. All your fears are gone. <laughs> what is that I'm hearing? Don't you bust up my son! <laughs> he lives! He lives! I'm a grandfather! Yes, he's alive! My son is alive! May the gods be praised! May the gods be praised! May the gods be praised! The eagle has landed. He has landed. The eagle has landed. Finally. What troubles you, my husband? The same thing, the same issue that has troubled me for years. Your ambition? Yes, to be the king of this land. 
and my only daughter, the princess of this land, and see my only daughter married to the prince of Umezema and Zekenda. We are close to it already. What happened? <sighs> so I talked until I forgot you were a giver me. Fade you? How? How? But he has never for once fed you. He fed me this time. The boy is alive. What? My husband. You don't mean it. The great man of Umozome Kingdom. Aqua, stop the Helen. Aqua, you have failed. Blasphemy! Blasphemy! Be careful with your choice of words, lest you incur the wrath of Omaliko to yourself. I am just coming back from the palace. My brother's wife gave birth to a bouncing baby boy. The boy is alive. The boy lives. What? What did you just say? Exactly what you heard. That's not possible. I am Aqua Tiwara Aki, the celebrated chief press of Obaniko. No mortar challenges me. No. That's not possible. Aqua, they just did. The boy is alive. Adeze, my daughter. I want you to sleep with me tonight. My heart is broken. All your brothers that came before you, they all left. They left your mother and I. Even though know, Nochi, and everyone was happy that he made it alive. Suddenly, he left like his brothers like a splash of the light at this my heart is broken your father is a man of many sorrows i'm sorry daddy thank you my daughter please sleep with me tonight please
you went out of your way to take your destiny in your hands. I am here to take my whatever steps you are planning to take dies with you. My destiny, no one can change. Be married. <laughs> My son is here. Yes. The eagle has landed. Yes. All the Jay is here. I want to tell you a story of how I ended my 20 years of misery. Igwe, go ahead, we are all ears. We are in the mood of celebration, Your Highness. Yes. You can go on with the story. After my wife gave birth to 10 male children, who all died at childbirth. She took him and gave birth to our 11th child, my daughter, Adeze, and she survived. The survivor of Adeze opened my eyes. I now discovered that what was happening to me was not ordinary. And to confirm it, our next son was born dead. My wife gave birth to my 11th son, a stillborn. That was when I decided to take my destiny by my own hands. Spirits of our land. Gods of our land. Spirits of our ancestors. Gods of our forefathers. Today, I, Igor Ranye, I stand at a point where four parts meet naked and I declare that I have not done any evil against any man. I have not forcefully taken away from any man what belongs to him. I have not paid anyone with evil. If I am telling lies, let my sons keep dying at bed. But if I am not telling lies, 
Let my sons live for me. Please do not allow my enemy to succeed in his ploy to deprive me and my lineage, the throne of our ancestors. Gods of our land, gods of our ancestors, gods of our forefathers. My wife, two years to take him after the exercise. But at the fullness of time, today, Onotia is here. He's alive. Yes. Igwe, it pays to do good. Mm -hmm. And Igwe, the best legacy on earth is living a pure and a honest life. Mm. With your four Ghana. Okay. Mm. Eat and make men. I have more drinks. More drinks. More food to eat. So eat to your satisfaction. One more chair is here. Thank you. Your brother decided to take his destiny in his own hands by embarking on a more deadly ritual. A ritual that is more potent than the sacrifice you made. What ritual are you talking about? The ritual of the meeting point on the four market days of the week. Eke, Ori, Afo. That is the greatest ritual that has ever been. It is a ritual done by those whose ends are clean. It can neutralize any other ritual. Ah, wow. <clears throat> you know how ambitious I have been always been about this throne. I prefer losing my life than to lose this throne. Aqua, do something, do something. It's in there. It's in there. It's in there. Obo tare na wonyo no Wonyo no Mi roke Ese me mi no wa Mi roke Okay mi roke What do you want me to do Awa you know what to do I want the boy dead even as we speak Send me one, you know. Oh, boys, they go shatter and I want you know. Be okay. Send me no one. Oh, you know, I mean one. One, 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 you all. Oh, you know, I mean one. One, you do it. Be ro. Be ro. Is the question I would do as you wish. But be rest assured, I have no hand in this. This blood will be upon your head and not my head. On this ground I stand, I swear. Let the blood be on my head, on my children's head, on my children's children's head. Gods of our Lord. May no evil befall this one. Iwe, nothing shall happen to your son. You see? Yes! Nothing shall happen to him! Onoche will not die. As long as he was born alive, as long as he breathes till this moment, he shall not die. He will. Yes! He live. cannot die. He will live. My son is alive. He cannot die. Doctor! If it is bad news, 
better keep it to yourself. All I want from you is my son. Where is son not here, my son? Uh, uh, doctor, were you able to do anything? We are waiting. Talk to us. Oh, yes, I'm itching. Oh. Well, he died before they got to the hospital. I tried all I could. We tried everything we know to revive him. But it all proved abortive. God's forsaking us. No, Tule, the gods has forsaken us. Sorry, my husband. <laughs> I'm so sorry I've disappointed you again. <laughs> I'm sorry, please, my <laughs> dear. No, you didn't disappoint me. You did not. You gave me a son. You gave me honor to hear my son. But that, which has vowed to never let go, didn't rest. Even after everything I did to make him leave. Now it is clear to me that a man of many sorrows I am, I was destined for so many troubles. Hey! <laughs> Sit down, my queen. Sit down. <laughs> Sit down. My king, Igwe, my brother, what am I here? That my nephew is dead. As a question. As a question, my brother. Our joy has been cut short suddenly. Hi! <laughs> Has been taken away from us. <laughs> we are now as empty and as sorrowful as we used to be. I brothers that came before you, they all left. They left your mother and I. Even though Nochi and everyone was happy that he made it alive, suddenly he left like his brothers, like a splash of the light. At this, my heart is broken. 
Your father is a man of many sorrows. I'm sorry, Daddy. Thank you, my daughter. Please sleep with me tonight, please. So my brother couldn't survive the death of his last son. Hey! Dead. How wicked can you be? Taking father and son the same day. How? I saw the pain all over him yesterday. He couldn't bear it. Ndoka, you are very right. A great king has gone. There is none like our king. We only pray that his gentle soul rests in the bosom of the gods. The gods are wise. Indeed, they are. The Iroko has fallen. Where is the little princess Abel? Where is she? Yes, that reminds me. Adeze! Adeze! This girl will be Adeze! Adeze, you don't put me into more trouble. Adeze, where are you? Adeze, where are you? Hey, what are you doing here? I've been looking for you everywhere. I've been looking for you everywhere in this palace. Hey, what are you hiding there? I was afraid. You were afraid? Afraid of who? I, I saw him. You saw who? I saw my uncle. I, I saw him killing my father. <laughs> Listen, listen, look at me, my princess. Don't you ever, don't you ever utter this word singing from this mouth. Did you hear that? Do you want to put us into trouble? Please, don't say that again, okay? Don't say anything. Okay, let's go, okay? Let's go. Let's go, don't worry, you'll be fine, okay? Don't say that again, don't say that again, you won't. Did you hear me? Don't say that to anyone. Let's go. Let's go. Mother. Mother, you were so scared of death. But you still lost your life barely one month after your husband was killed. 
Mother, your mysterious death is not a mystery to me at all. I am very sure that they are the one who snipped life out of you just to silence you. So that they can complete the task they have started. But one thing I, I don't know, one thing I am not sure, I'm, I'm so concerned about is your silence. Why are you keeping silence in the life beyond? Why are you not doing something? Now what is rightfully mine is, is being taken away from me. Your daughter is about to get married to the Prince of Umu, the Manzi Kingdom. And I, the legitimate Princess of Umu, Zome Kingdom, is left with nothing. Father, Mother, is this how you two are going to be silent? Are you going to allow me to continue to suffer like this for the rest of my life? Mother, please do something. Mother, please do something. I'm begging you. I am tired. I am tired. <laughs> I'm tired. Please. What is this? Princess is angry with you. With me? She has been searching for you since. Why? You left the palace without telling her now. Is that all? She said she reports to her chamber once you come back. Thank you. Lame brother. She reports to her chamber when she come back. When the people give somebody BP in this palace. In the way she just dragged me. I thought some, somebody has died in this palace. Every smut and everything they will be doing in this palace. Women my for name mad. Let me collapse before my time because I'm, I'm, I'm working in this palace. If you people kill me, you do, everybody will rest. And my soul will rest in peace. Oh, let my soul rest in peace right now. The way this is for me, this palace, my soul can't Because the stuff that I'm so in this palace. How dare you, my princess? Shut up. How dare you leave your duty post? Hmm? I'm sorry, my Shut up! That is the problem with humans. You think anytime you say sorry, everything becomes right. You went out of this palace without informing anybody. You think you can just wake up one beautiful morning and do anything that suits you without any form of constraint? Do you remember your position in this palace? If you don't, I will give you a soft reminder. You are nothing but a mere palace maid. You are my slave. You have no right to your own time, to your own space, at your own will. You won't do anything until I ask you. Have I made myself clear? I just do that. You just what? Stop talking when I am talking. Sorry for your silly self. Now listen to me. You will go out there, kneel under the sun. That is your punishment. You won't rise up from that spot until I ask you to. Are you still standing there staring at me? Sorry, Shush away from here! Get away! Look at her looking like an overcooked earthworm. Rubbish! With my eyes full of tears Let's 
Why must I marry from Umozome Kingdom? And why must I marry the princess? You don't seem to like them, do you? I haven't said that, Father. So why the question? You don't seem to understand me, Father. Maybe I don't. Father, there are lots of beautiful girls right here in this kingdom. Why do I have to travel hundreds of kilometers to a particular kingdom to marry from a particular family? That is spiritual, son. That is divine. It is sacred. We may not know why because we grew up to meet the ordinance. But the least we can do is to follow it up as handed down to us by our forefathers. It is said that in every fourth generation, the prince of Umwezemazi must marry the princess of Umwezeme kingdom. That is how the gods have made it and that is how we have kept it till this very day. But times have changed, Father. Isn't it time we question these ordinances and heritage, especially the ones we don't know why they were ordained in the first place? Isn't that why you sent your children to school? We are royalty, not commoners. We should be the custodian of the culture and ordinances, and not the ones fighting it. Son, I wouldn't want us to discuss this any further. Get ready to visit your bride tomorrow. But father, I... Oh, this discussion is over. Nobody wants to listen to your point of view. You must do things their way. Come on. Don't I have the right to ask questions? Especially with things that concern my, my life. This is my life we're talking about here. It's my marriage. It's my marriage, goddammit. It's, it's my life we're talking about here. I have every right to ask questions. Shelly, I am sending you with my son. He knows nothing about the culture and the tradition. You are to be his guardian angel. Make sure it doesn't slip his feet or his tongue. Is that understood? Yes, your majesty. Trust me, I will take care of this. I trust you. Where is he? Send someone to his room and call him. We don't have all the time in the world. Let me look for one of the guards to do that, sir. They passed about it. Thank you, Your Majesty. Please, Carrie, do this one. <laughs> Easy. Easy does it. <gasps> Easy? Easy does it. What the hell is wrong with you? You want to strangle me? Sorry, Get please. away here! Shush away! Hmm. Rubbish! Hmm. Can somebody just tell me how beautiful I am looking today? My princess. Hmm? You're very beautiful and all blander. Oh my goodness! Thank you! Thank you. <laughs> My princess. Yes, darling. Beautiful is our understatement. 
You look so beautiful. Oh my goodness, thank you. But next time you add the word gorgeous. Say gorgeous. Gorgeous. I want to see your veins. Gorgeous. Oh, God. <laughs> thank you. And then you say, what do you have to say? My princess, they have said it all. They have said what all? Hmm? I am asking you, what have they said? Can't you say something beautiful in your own words? Can't you give me appraisals, make me feel like a princess that I am? Was I the one who asked the gods to take the throne from your father and hand it over to mine? Was I the gods who killed your parents? Hmm. Listen, it's a happy day for me. I do not want you to get me upset. You will do yourself well and behave like a normal human being. Do I make myself clear? Sorry hmm. for your dead parents! Huh? My yes, my darling. Oh, Baby elephant. Which? You are not keeping your leg warm. What did you say? See, what did I hear you say? Octopus. Baby octopus. Yes, go on, darling. My princess, hmm. whether she says it or not, it makes no difference. Your beauty radiates like the morning sun. My goodness. Whom the gods has favor. No one can What nonsense did you just spit? I asked, what nonsense did you spit? I, was I asked again, what nonsense did you spit? I was praising you. Praise your dead parents and your godforsaken life. Made. Yes, you were saying. My princess, hmm. whether she says it or not, it makes no difference. Your beauty radiates like the morning sun. My goodness. Whom the gods has favor, no one can come. You see you? You must definitely make heaven. Thank you, my princess. <laughs> Go ahead. Don't let this witch touch me. <laughs> oh. I look so beautiful. Gosh, how did God create me this beautiful? In the morning. In the morning, right? Welcome, welcome to my kingdom. Welcome, Prince Uche. Oh. Welcome, my friends. Hmm. You're welcome, our dear August visit. Okay. The prince doesn't seem to be happy. I think he's happy, definitely happy. Come on, he's a prince. He doesn't need to flash his teeth like a tout. Is he? It's all right. <laughs> Thank you so much, Your Majesty. We are happy to be here. You're welcome. All right, so, shall we go inside? Ah. 
Come. Once more, I welcome the Prince of Umezamazi Kingdom. I welcome you to the kingdom of Umozume, my kingdom. I take it that you know why you are here. And without any waste of time, I invite the queen to summon my daughter to come and bid welcome to her husband mm. to be. Igwe. It's me. I feel so much like Cinderella. You remember when the clock rang at 12 and the prince was around the corner, the nook and cranny of the town, looking for her the next day to find who owned the shoe that was left at the palace. I feel like my prince is here to look for me. <laughs> you understand the story, right? <laughs> my goodness. I feel loved already. <laughs> Oh gosh. Hmm. Easy. My sunshine. Oh mom. <laughs> my all and all. Mom. My angel. Oh mom. Hmm. What's going on? You look gorgeous already. I know, Mom. Um, <laughs> your father the king hmm. has sent for you to come and welcome. Our August visitor. He's here? Yes. Oh, I I, I hope you are ready. Mom, I was born ready. Good. Always ready. Good. <laughs> <laughs> you, Adese, you will be in front. I will be directly behind you. Two other maidens behind me. I have one in front to guide me and two behind to guide me, Mom. What do you think? That's my job. Um, <laughs> oh, one, gosh! One more thing. Yes, my dear. The, the prince doesn't seem to be happy. So I want you to put more effort, at least to make him smile at the sight of you. Is that it? Yes. Mother, have you seen the daughter you gave birth to? <laughs> have you seen me take a walk, mother? I look like the Queen of England. I know what you Mother, no mean. man born of a woman will see a beautiful face as mine and not smile. It is not possible. <coughs> I know what you can do. I know what you can do. It what is, is not possible? Yes. Okay? I know. I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh, Mom. I'm waiting for you. I'll be right there. Good. And why oh. wait? Why wait? We were choking, we choked to death. Which? <laughs> and as for you, you smile so much. You don't join the train. Tell Orochi she will go with us. You stay back you here. With us, you stay back here and smile to the boss. <laughs> go back. Back! It's not tight enough. Back! Your Majesty, my Princess. <laughs> my
my prince. You, you are welcome. <laughs> You're welcome. You're welcome, my prince. Um, <clears throat> my name is Princess Oma, the ever gorgeous, beautiful Princess Oma, the one you you have come to see. Oh, you. Yes, me. Um, you're welcome. You're welcome to my humble abode, peaceful abode. You are welcome. I see. Um, you see? Is that all you have to say? I mean, am I not um, beautiful enough? <laughs> um, is, is anyone disputing your beauty? Oh. No, of course. No one can dispute that. But, you know, I was expecting you to say more. Like, I am elegant, beautiful, outstanding, gorgeous. Um, <laughs> yes. Uh, well, maybe you're just seeing things the wrong way. There's no disputing the fact that you're beautiful. You are. Thank you very much, my prince. Thank you. <laughs> um, <clears throat> prince Uche, uh, I am delighted to note that your wife to be has bid you a rousing and warm welcome. Um, it is left for the maids to do their job. Yes. Yes, Father. Yes. Let the maids do their job. Serve the prince, and of course, we serve ourselves. You are a graduate of sociology from the prestigious Harvard University. With a distinction, my prince. Don't forget to add. That's interesting. Thank you. Tell me. Tell me you don't see anything wrong with this archaic and mundane marriage arrangements. What do you mean by that? In this modern time, after all the exposure you've gotten from studying abroad, are you telling me you don't see anything wrong with this marriage arrangement? You still haven't said anything to my understanding. <laughs> what do you mean? Tell me, apart from pictures, have you ever seen me or met me anywhere in the world before? No. What is this all about? How can two perfect strangers be made to marry each other just because of some stupid and unreasonable ordinance? Oh, uh, now I see where you were coming from. Mm. But I'll tell you this for free, my prince. We shouldn't let education and exposure deny us our culture. We should be promoting it instead. This is our heritage. We should uplift it and not castigate it. I see. <laughs> well, so who was that girl that was ahead of the procession when you came to greet me? Who exactly are you talking about? The maiden, the one that was directly in front of you. Excuse me. Princess. I don't know 
why he is acting so unhappy and well. I know. You know? Yes, mother, I do. It's a daisy. Yes. A daisy cast a spell on him. Who is a daisy? Oh, father, don't sound like you don't know who I am talking about. I'm talking about the daughter of that pauper, your late brother's daughter. <laughs> How did you come to this hasty conclusion? Oh, Father, come on. When we stepped out, I mean to greet my husband to be, he had his focus only on a daisy. What? How is that supposed to be, Father? Take a good look at me. Don't I look good? You do. And he kept looking at that little nitwit that looks like a squirrel who escaped from the zoo. Monkey. Father, a monkey for that yes. matter, and left the princess, his wife to be. How do you explain that? Uh, huh. Really? Mother, really? A few minutes ago when we were taking a walk, mm. he, he, he started talking about why I felt so comfortable with this arrangement, to the point that he called our custom a cake and mundane. What? Uh -huh. Yes, father. And then he started asking about her. Again? Huh. <sighs> No. No, no, no. This is not ordinary, Mother. No. Because I don't see how a man who came to this palace all of a sudden changes his mind and starts asking about that little rat. She did something. Yes. Mother, she did something. I am certain she did something. Okay, please. Yes. You have to do something. Please. Mm. Now my daughter. Father. My daughter. Father. My darling daughter. Father. My adorable daughter. Oh. Now come on. No. 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 Brighten up. Brighten up. Brighten up. Brighten up. Now that's better. Now I want you to pretend that all of that never happened. Yes, please. You understand? Please. Look at your father. Mm -hmm. Your father is on top of the situation. Good. Can I show you that? Good. Okay? Okay, father. Okay? okay. Yes. Yeah. Good. Please calm down. Now, okay. Let's go back yes. there. They're That's waiting. Right. Okay? Right. Come on, just. Come on, come on. I just want to do some touch about you. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Prince Uche, I believe you may have to go back to your kingdom and to your father, the king. You have come and you've seen us. You have also seen the great princess of this kingdom, your bride-to-be. Our next discussion is going to be about the marriage rights proper. That's assuming there will be a marriage. Your Majesty, we have heard what you said. Be rest assured that the next time we are visiting your palace, it must be about the marriage proper. As you can see, the prince is very happy and excited about your hospitality. He will go back and have a word with his father, just like you advised. 
Thank you very much, Your Majesty. My king. My king. was that all about Charlie? Why did you have to keep interrupting me? Why did you get, have to keep speaking for me like, like I'm a child? Like I can't have any thoughts of my own? I don't have my op own opinion? I can't speak for myself? Your father sent me there for a reason. It is not possible for me to just sit back and watch you ruin everything that he stands for. Whatever the reason you think you were sent there for is useless if you're not there to protect me, if you're not there to defend my decisions, okay? I'm the principal. You were there just to accompany me, not to be a chaperone, not to speak for me, okay? I could speak for myself. I could have said whatever it is I wanted to say by myself. I didn't need you speaking for me. Look. The only reason why I am there is to guide you not to go astray. I mean, how can I sit back there and, and then watch you say those unguarded words to the king? Your father is going to hold me responsible for anything that happens there today. Hold you responsible? I hear you say. You heard me right. How can my father hold you responsible for my actions? What is wrong with everyone? You don't seem to understand. I don't, don't need to understand anything. Okay? That was really, really unnecessary. I, 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 was, I was totally embarrassed. I couldn't just say anything without you interrupting. I don't know what you're talking about, my princess. Liar! You are a bloody little liar! I am not lying, my princess. I am not lying. I don't lie. <laughs> I want you to tell me the truth. And if you say the truth, I will forgive you. Yes, I will tell you the truth. Good. Go ahead. Did you or did you not cast a spell on the visiting prince? Oh, I did not cast a spell on... I don't, I don't know how to cast a spell on someone. Okay, how am I supposed to cast a spell on somebody I don't know? I've never seen the prince. I'm, I swear, I've never seen him before. That was, today was the first time I saw him. Shh, 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 Oh, now you want to play smart. You think you know everything. Answering a question with another question. See, if I was you, eh? If I slap you, that's the truth. I did not cast a spell on him. What do you mean by that nonsense? What do you mean you didn't cast a spell on him? A young man who came to see me, the gorgeous princess of Umozome started hating me when he saw you to the extent he kept asking who the girl is someone who drove kilometers all the way from his village to come see me 
no one wants to know more about you than me, the princess. And you say you did not cast a spell on him? Start talking now, else I will run into your spirits. Now! But how am I supposed to know? Yeah, you know, yeah, when he came. He was here when I came inside. Yeah, he started looking at me. You not covered me. Two of us were not turning up and down. You were turning, I was turning. You were looking at me. Shut up! Hey, hey. Ah, uh, uh, it's enough. I beg you, you can lie. I say enough! Ah. Father, I, I said it's enough! Come on. I will deal with this issue myself, my own way. Let the maid be. Oh, Father, I now I see. want you out of here. All of you, leave. Leave. Come, 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 Say the nonsense that brought you to my room and make sure you get the hell out immediately you are done. I just want to let you know that I would never do anything to hurt you. Yes, I admit it. I am not happy that my birthright was taken away from me. But that is not enough reason for me to wish you bad. I have never seen the prince. I don't know anything about him. I am happy that you're getting married to the prince. I know had it, had it been my parents were alive, I would have been the person to get married to him. I was upset at first, but I understand such is life. You reek of jealousy. You reek of anger. You are nothing but a low life papa. You think your birthright was actually taken away from you? The gods who are so wise took it away from your father and gave it to mine because they know he deserves it. You do not know my father. I would hit you so hard if you talk back at me again. Now get your little self out of my room. Little monster. Raised by parents who knows nothing. That is why your parents died without achieving anything. Died the same way. Bastard. Ah, oh. Why is my father treating me this way? Why is he bent on this royal ordinance without considering my feelings, my happiness? Why? What do I do now? Because I can't imagine myself getting married to that arrogant, crazy princess. But wait a minute. Who is that maiden that came before her? There is something very special about her that I must find out. That girl is not just an ordinary maiden, no. She's not. There's something sacred, something quite special about her. I may not be able to place a finger on it, but I can feel it deep down in my spirit that she's a special being. that that idiot 
That little nitwit is diabolic. Nobody believed me. You all thought I was just ranting. Have I not been vindicated? Take a look at it, Father. It's right there in front of you. When did she leave the palace? This morning, this very morning. And that's how she leaves the palace every day. I had to send him to trail her. Voila! She went to that bush, that same bush, to that dirty, sacred tree. Can you believe it? Right under my roof. Right under your roof. Just right under your roof, Father. Wait a minute. Could this be some modern day Photoshop? No, Your Majesty. There are pictures I took with my phone. No filter, no photo editing. Your Majesty. Mm. Hmm. <laughs> it's unbelievable. Very unbelievable. But Father, take a look at it. This girl must be diabolic. This girl, Nako, on a maven. I'm telling you, Father, she's a witch. Come on. Where is, where is this? Inside Epa Forest. I was following her, but she didn't know that I was following her till we got to the forest. I saw her tie clothes around the tree. Chineke? Yes, Your Highness. I also saw some other materials before she started talking to the tree. Talk? Hey! Are they talking to a tree? Hey! This girl won the more She is a baby witch. A witch. Is she back in this palace? Not yet, Your Highness. Alright. I want to see her directly she returns. Yes, Your Highness. Like immediately she comes back. Immediately. It's no problem. Get away. Who keeps this? Father, you see what I've been saying? That girl is a witch. Who who was this from? Who? To the, the guard, of course. I'll keep it. Yes, you need to, Father, for evidence. I'll because we can't it. just keep talking and talking without evidence. Hi! Evidence. Hmm. How? How? Hey, hey, hey! I'm sure she wants to kill you, Father. And kill me. And oh, kill her. Oh, papa. Oh, papa. Oh, papa. Hey, Chimo. <laughs> eh? Mom, you don't need to scream. Because I said it. I kept saying that this girl is diabolical, but none of you believe me. You all thought I was talking nonsense. Can you see it? This is it. So where did she learn this high level of sorcery from? Eh? Who taught her? Mom, you're asking me, who am I supposed to ask? <laughs> I don't understand why you're asking me that question. I wouldn't know. I don't know. Well, what did your father say? Well, Father is as surprised as you are. But I would advise something needs to be done about that girl mother. Of course. She's a witch. A witch. Hmm. Hmm. Uh -uh. Imagine. Huh? Hmm. Can't even look at the pictures. See you that time. Where are you going to? You were busy. You were busy. He's calling me names. This one down, down. Calling me names. Is that why you're now you have landed person? yourself into big trouble. Which trouble is that? See, no, you, see, just go straight to the king's chamber. He's waiting for you there. You are in big problem, big one. Waiting for me. The king is waiting for me. Just ask him one question. What did he say I did? 
Okay, I see, I see the question. Did you, see, did you say I did anything bad? No, I don't know that one. Just run, see what you just turn, turn, turn like this. Face that side. Run and go inside straight before the king will start looking for you. You're a big problem, a big one. Did the king tell you what I did? You are seeing asking me more questions. When you are calling me names, you don't know. Go inside, go and meet the king. Sorry, I'll not call you names. He will come out now. Go inside. Was, was the king angry? Was he shouting when he told you? You are seeing that picture? Yes, Good. Whose picture is it? It's my picture that is inside the phone. Eh? You? Hmm. Yes, it's me that is inside the phone. You? Yes, you have this. Oh. So you've started appearing inside a phone. I see. Before long now, you'll start appearing in other phones. And television. And television. Yes. And people will be watching you. And that's what you want, right? Eh? Eh? Mm, okay, now tell me. Look at that picture again. Tell me, where is that place? What were you doing at the point in time that picture was taken? I was not doing anything, nothing. Oh, anymore. shut the hell up before I shut that gutter you call a mouth. What do you mean you were doing nothing? Oh, you listen to me and listen good. If you don't say the truth, I swear by the demons who created you, I will strangle you. Now speak! No. I... 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 Oh, please, mother. Allow your father handle this situation. Mother, you, you, you need to see the way my heart is burning right now. I understand. I understand. Please calm down. Oh, Butu. Mother, stop it. Stop telling me to Butu. Stop it! Adeze, Adeze, now listen to me. Answer the question from the king. Answer him! All right. I will ask again. For the last time, look at that picture. An answer. One. Where is that place? Then, what were you doing in that place at the point in time that picture was taken? Your Highness, it's, it's a forest in Ikba. The Ikba forest. And I was not doing anything serious at all. No. Yes, it was something. So it's not a serious something. What? Did you hear that? Ikba. Ikba forest. Did you hear that? <coughs> ah, she has started visiting the forest. I see. Ah. All right. What's that unserious thing you were doing there? Your Highness, as I told you, it's something not serious. It's a communication, a spiritual communication between me and the dead. Hey! No, it's not a bad communication. It's me that created the communication. Oh, wait, wait, wait. You now talk to the dead? No, it's not them that started it. It's me that started the communication. It's not um. ah! There are things I'm not supposed to hear. Hmm. See. See. Um. <sighs> the
This girl is supposed to be locked up in the cell, the palace cell. Good. So get the guards to bang her inside the palace cell until I decide on what to do with her. Yes. I had every chance to eliminate her when I eliminated her parents. I had all the chances in the world, but I chose not to. A decision I regret now. Who knows how far she can go in her sorcery and witchcraft? Who knows? Well, it is not yet late. Thank God she showed herself early enough. Let me just... that song so particular to my soul and that voice whose voice is that what's the connection between that voice and my soul why why does it make my heart beat I'm 
go say. If it were in the olden days. Sorcery and witchcraft against the royal family had one punishment death by hanging. However, these days, these things have been watered down, they've been toned down. Punishment has been watered to mere banishment and excommunication for life. From the village. So, elders, no. Tomorrow, this girl will proceed on banishment and excommunication from this village. Live! I'm innocent! I'm innocent! After tomorrow, anyone that sees her in this village and fails to report to the royal house will be faced also with banishment and excommunication. She's evil and should not be seen in this village. Igumi, what I can't just believe is how the last surviving member of the family of late Igwe Oranya, royal blood for that matter, would be involved in such evil as witchcraft and sorcery. I just I still can't believe it. You have to believe it. You have to believe it because it is true. I'm not a witch or no one. No, please believe me. I'm not a witch. <laughs> but Igwe, we did not hear from her before the judgment was passed on her. That's why no one Igwe. Exactly my heart, Igwe. What if she has a different version of the story? Different version. Hmm. Different version when I showed you people the evidence. Concrete evidence in a pool. With this day modern technology, hmm? pictures can lie. Exactly. Please, I would like to beg you. We need to be seen as being fair. If my elders here say we haven't given her a chance to speak for herself, I think we need to take it. Please, let her speak. Please, Igwe. Adema. All right, all right. That's it. So. Tell them why you were held captive in the royal cell. Tell them what happened in the beginning. Man, that's a good day. Oh, 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 day. Mboku. Mboku. Mboku, see where we Come on, open the gates for me. Good now. Come on, open the gates for me. Is it hard or or witty? My friend, where are you going? I don't understand. Who are you to question me? When did this one start? Will you gonna open the gate for me? Hey, 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 see, see, don't shout at me. Don't shout, don't even try it. See, you are a maid. I'm a gate man. You are in the same level. The last time I checked, you're not the princess of this kingdom. Don't shout at me. You don't blame me. It's the poverty that has affected your breed that I blame. Mm. Pan white tapa. Mm. Open the gates. I what are you going and becoming? Hmm? Look at his face, Cap. Every time he will not come this here, looking like a barman. It's okay, you. Eh? I will not open this gate for you if you talk to me. This is totally unusual. 
Not that foolish gate man that is following me. I will just break his head. It's even the trees and the breeze. Father, mother, I'm here again. I know you can hear me. The amount of pain and mockery I am subjected to is something I can no longer handle. The abuse, the insults, they are too much for me, Father. I know that if you were here, this would not have happened. But no, you two left me in this wicked world. If you were here, I would not be treated like a slave in my own father's palace. I am here to tell you people that you two should do something. Do something now before I lose my mind and come to join you there. I'm telling you now, oh, do something, oh. I'm already losing my mind. Do something, oh. Do something, oh. I am losing it, so you have to do something before I join you there. You have to do something, Father. Who is there? Who are you? Show yourself! Show yourself! If you are man enough, show yourself! Who are you? Adesi, if what you just said is right, what you said is that you go into the bush to communicate with your parents regularly. Hmm? But your parents are dead. So how come you are communicating with the dead? Spiritual communication, you don't understand. Six. 
You see it. What else do you call that? If not witchcraft and sorcery. My other, at this point, it is clear. It is very clear. She is involved in witchcraft and sorcery. The judgment must stand. Oh, no, no. Where are these My guys? Where are these guys? Yes. This is it. This is it. This 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 is it. This is the place. Yeah, I I, I can feel it stronger. My love, wh where are you? Wh show yourself, please. I I'm here for you, my love. Where are you? It's coming from here. Where? Where are you? Where are you? My love! Why? Where is she? He's here. Why can't I see you? Why can't I see you? Where are you? My love! Please show yourself. I'm here for you. Canta 
That song, that voice, whose voice is that? Why, what's going on with me? I, am I going insane? I hope I'm not going insane. Why do I keep having this dream? Who's that? Who are you? Who are you? Amen. Good morning, my prince. Good morning, Charlie. My prince, you look worried. That's because I'm worried. What could be the thing that worries my prince? Charlie, for some time now, I've been having this strange recurring dream. Dreams? I sleep. And in my dream, I hear a song. A very emotional song. Song has a way of connecting to my soul. It, it, it brings a very strong emotional response from me. I don't know the voice behind the song. And in that dream, I find myself wanting to know the source of the song. And then I go in search, I follow the voice. And every time it seems like I'm getting closer to, to, the, to the voice, it, it goes farther away just keeps eluding me. No matter how hard I try, I, I, I just can't seem to get to the source of that song. Until last night, I finally got to the source of the voice of the song and I could hear the song very loudly. I couldn't see anyone. I couldn't see the singer. I mean, like the song was all over me. I, I could feel it. It was just everywhere. But I just couldn't see the singer. I, I, I need to know what my connection is to that song and to the singer, Charlie. My prince, I would have loved to help, but I am not good in interpreting dreams. Don't you know anyone who can help me? My prince, I know someone, yes, but I will take you to the person when you are ready. Okay. Okay. Besides, um, your father wants to see you. 
isn't it too early for the king to disturb me with this marriage issue to that crazy, arrogant girl? My prince, is it not too early for you to keep the king waiting? I'll join him shortly. My prince. He's now the king. What he says stands. As he came and went, I came. One on your own road. Come and get a man. Oh, get a boy. Get a man. Get a man. Come on, go on your own. Come and go, 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 go. No, no, get a boy. Good morning, Father. Good morning, sir. You called for me. Yes, I did. Please sit. Son? I personally want to inform you that we, I mean you and I, will be visiting our in-laws next tomorrow. I want you to clear your schedule, prepare your mind for the visit. Hmm. Okay, I've heard you, Father. Very well, then. You may leave. Can I ask a question, Father? As long as it's a reasonable question. It depends on what you consider reasonable. Of course. Any question that will try to demean and undermine your union with Princess Oma is an unreasonable question. And I will not take it. Really? You know that already. <sighs> okay. As you wish, Father. It's all right. Open your danger. He has no conscience. Not at all. Yes, I have to leave this throne, this palace, this kingdom, everything for him and find myself before I get lost completely. What is this? You want to practically force an adult like me to marry someone I don't have an iota of love for? What nonsense. What nonsense. This is total unusual. From princess to palace bedding on the Zimba. You have taught a royal court.
of sun seeding, ruling her life. You made her a wanderer, walking from place to place. Yes. Good afternoon. Yes. What do you want? Good afternoon, ma. Oh, oh, water. Such a total of water. Such a total. Such a total is twenty more. Mm. You must be very tasty, you. Let me get you more. My money is 16 naira. Okay. Which one is okay? Pay me my money. I don't have money to pay you. Meaning, a full grown girl like you dressed in this manner, you must be joking. Oh, I wish I'm joking. I'm not joking. I was banished from my kingdom for something I did not do. They lied against me. Hey. And I've been trekking since. As we speak now, I'm a fugitive. I don't even have anywhere I'm going to stay this night. They pursued me out of, out of the palace. Empty handed, not even with a pant, a bra, or any of my clothes. It's just me they pursued. I'm, I'm hungry, but. I know I don't have money, so that's why I, I asked for pay out. That's wickedness. Are you sure you have eaten anything since morning? I am not eating anything, I'm hungry. Your story is just a pathetic one. Thank you. People are really facing a lot of challenges in this life, but this is entirely on another level. Tell me. Well, it's come to think of it. Are you sure you're not guilty of all the allegations? How much sure that what you told me was exactly how it all happened? I am telling you the truth. I am... I am not guilty. How can I trust you? I don't know you. I understand. But with time you will trust me. With time you will know if I'm a bad person or a good person. You look so innocent. Thank you. I see you as a nice person. Thank you. But looks can be deceitful. Huh. Let me just believe you. Thank you. Gala. Gala. Good afternoon, How was your journey? It was fine. Oh, Adeze, meet Jidena, my boyfriend. Jidena, meet Adeze, my new friend. I'll tell you about her later. Good afternoon, brother. Welcome. Come on, I'm see you first. Okay, then. I'll be right back. Please, don't let them say bad things about me. I'm wearing a scarf in my back. Mm. 
Who is she? It's a long story. My friend, will you answer my question? Who is she? I was here when she came to buy such such at water. She was looking so hungry. So I gave her such at water, but she didn't have any money on her to pay me. That's when I became curious to know why someone like her wouldn't have any money on her. And that's when she told me her story. Uh, so what's her story? That's what I want to know. She's from Umuzome Kingdom. She was banished out of her kingdom empty-handed for a crime she did not commit. Ruchi. What? Did you hear a safe talk? Like, did you listen to yourself? Someone that was banished. You, you brought her in. You brought in a witch. A murderer. A, a thief. But you don't know her. I know before someone can be banished. See, there is a thief, a murderer, or a witch. What are you trying to say? Holy oh, you're a fool. I, I thought you were a wise girl. I thought, I thought you have sense. Huh? Adeze! Adeze! Adeze, yeah? Please, leave my shop. But sister, I am not your sister. I cannot be a sister to a murderer, to a thief and a witch and I can never harbor you in my space. Leave here now. Uh, sister, why are you talking like this now? Shebi, you were the one that promised that you were going to help me, sister. sister I didn't say like again. You said you were I going didn't to say, do something very stupid. Sister, please do not allow your boyfriend to deceive you now. Please, I'm begging you. You are a nice person. Don't allow him to. Your boyfriend, don't allow him to deceive you. He's like he does not like me. Please, I'm begging you. Please, don't allow him to change your mind. Uh, 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 yeah. If you don't leave now. I will call the committee on you and they will deal with you just like a common criminal that you should get with. So you better leave now. I'm sorry, I will leave. I'll... Better leave. Okay. Nonsense. Thank God you came home. Gina was already planning for her to be living with us. You would have landed yourself in the big, biggest job of your life. Just keep someone that you don't know in your shop. You won't even take him to, the, to our Thank house. Thank God you came. Come on, give me water. This is one day, one day. May we wipe your tears away. Stop crying. Oh, my Hi. 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 Sorry. My name, my name is Adeze. I'm from Umuzume Kingdom. I didn't have anywhere to sleep. That was why I came to pass the night in the church. I saw the back door open. So I decided to sleep here. I'm not a bad person. Please don't report me. It's okay. It's okay. Um, just come with me. You want to go and report to me? No, 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 no. Let's come with me. Young lady, are you sure this was what happened before you were banished? Yes, father. Are you sure you are not telling me lies? Mother, I can't lie to you. This is what happened. I'm in the house of God and the Holy Spirit lives here. If I lie, you will surely know. Okay. Okay. <laughs> One good step you took is to come to the house of God. Okay. Because of that, I will connect you to a family you can be staying with till we get to the same place that we'll be working to start making some living. Father, get up, get up. I say get up. Thank you. Take. 
Money, father. Yes. With that money, I want you to go to the market, buy some new clothes. You need a change of clothes. You have to take your bath, then have something to change it. Okay, it's okay. Get up. I said you should get up. Stop this. This, this looks like a dream. Thank you so much. Nobody has helped me. My so. daughter, get up. Thank you. Now that the wicked ideas have been removed out of your way, let me see what will make the prince not to marry you. Mother, nothing. Absolutely nothing. I am certain that the spell has been removed from his eyes. What okay. the young man is going to behold me in his right senses. I am his and he is mine forever. Yes. Mm. Look at you. Mother, am I not beautiful? You are, my I'm gorgeous. not gorgeous. You are gorgeous. Am I not incredibly gorgeous? You are incredibly gorgeous. I am amazingly gorgeous. Yes, you are. <laughs> See, my daughter. Yes, mom. <laughs> if beauty was a person, hmm. you are an epitome of beauty. Oh, mother. Oh, mother. Oh, mother. Oh, Udara mecha. Um, stop it. Anya wotu to unwam. Stop it. Hmm? <laughs> stop it. Look mom. at you. Mom, stop it. Ha! Huh? <laughs> Udara mecha. Yes, mom. That's what you are. Thank you, mother. You are too beautiful. I glow. You are too beautiful to me. I glow. glow, mother. I glow. What are they talking about? I glow. Of course. <laughs> The king is ready. He asked me to call you. He is visiting Ezekwetche's palace with us today. Tell him I'm coming. But my prince, you have not had your bath yet. The king is ready and waiting. I'm coming. Tell him. I said I'm coming. I'm sorry my prince, but... Charlie! Good morning, Father. Good morning, son. Please sit down. Son, can you please brighten up your face? Today is a happy day. And not a day for mourning, you know it. A happy day for you. A mourning day for me. A mourning day for you? What exactly do you mean? Father, today my self-will was sacrificed. It's dead and gone. Sacrifice on the altar of your desires. I'm in mourning for him. <laughs> Son, some dates are better celebrated than mourned. Today is a happy day for you. Rejoice, my son. It calls for celebration. Don't forget, very soon we shall be leaving. Shall we? Shall we? This is so nice. Can somebody tell me how beautiful I'm looking? My princess, hmm. you look gorgeous as usual. Oh. <laughs> princess, hmm. 
You look so beautiful as never before. Oh my goodness, thank you. <laughs> but girls, next time you want to use the word gorgeous, you say it very well. Like gorgeous. 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 Like gorgeous. 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 <laughs> Thank you, girls. <laughs> Go ahead. Go ahead. Make sure you lay it for me. My daughter. This one. Huh? Are you here? Yes, I'm here. What is it? Um, our in laws are here now. Even you go, Kaka came with them. Yes. Your father said I should come and call you to come and point them. Are you serious? Yes. Mama, we are not even ready. I'm not ready. Oh no. You are beautiful the way you are. Really? Come, let's keep going. Okay, you know what, Mom? Just go keep them company. I want to walk in majestically as a princess that I am. I'll join you in a bit. Please. Okay? Make it snappy. I will, Mom. Okay. <sighs> Your Majesty. Yes. Your Majesty, this is it. Mm. Worthy of royalty. <laughs> the only queen of Umwezemaze kingdom. A replica of my late wife. Son, go and bring your wife to me. That's how it's done. Thank you very much, Your Majesty. I am so honored. You're welcome. Thank you. Donation. <laughs> Seeing your beautiful face has made my day. Yes. Um, Your Majesty, yes. permit me to ask that you allow your daughter to follow us home today. My son here has been complaining that both of them are total strangers to one another mm -hmm. getting married. That you allow your daughter to have two weeks vacation with us so that both of them and have time to bond together, get to know each other and possibly learn from one another before the marriage rites proper. Definitely. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Your Majesty, what do you have to say? What more do I have to say? Permission grant. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, Your Majesty. <laughs> It's a Sorry. 
mod just... Waka ko niti ga too much Waka so ili go let He's now the king What he says does Masika ma mwa ya ga mwa Mwa nyo so mwaro Kita mano, gata bun kita ya, kita ya ta mwa konyo sa Kama kopu bubwa, nono kebwa, hopi ya dinja He has no conscience, not at all Having a good time. Alone. You know, when I left my father's house to come be with you, I thought we were actually coming here to have fun. Have a good walk in the garden, a little cheat chat, crack me some jokes, take me out and make me feel wanted. What's going on? Since we arrived here, you've been obviously avoiding me. Why is that? You know, even after I've decided to accept this thing, I still find it difficult to accept you. <gasps> I have tried to take you in, but the more I try, the more difficult it is. Something about you doesn't sit right with me. Did, did you just say that to me? What exactly are you talking about? I'm only being honest to myself and to you. I don't like you. I've tried to force myself to, but it's not working. You don't have to force yourself! You have to like me, you have to be with me. We are meant to be together. Excuse me? Excuse you! have you. to what? Like me, I said! You know what? You disgust me. My father needs to hear this. Oh. I am so You complain that you've been forced to marry a total stranger. I saw reasons with you and made it possible for both of you to have time together so that you would not be strangers to yourselves. What else is your problem with now? Reality. What reality? What nonsense reality are you talking about? My spirit does not like her person, father. I don't like her. Her presence irritates me. 
Look, Father, I have tried my best to do your wish. I have buried myself and what I want for this marriage. But the fact remains that I don't like her. Fine, we'll go ahead with the marriage as you wish, but I don't need her around me. Hello, my dear. Mom, I don't feel good at all. I don't feel good. I'm not fine. What is it again? It's the prince. He hates me so much and he doesn't even hide it. He's so vocal and blunt about it, Mom. Mom, I, I feel terribly bad. Huh. I'm sorry about it, my dear. Don't cry. Yes. Don't cry. Crying will not change anything. But mom, why, why, why does he hate me so much? Why? He doesn't even want to see me. I wouldn't know, my dear. Maybe the spell is still working on him. Exactly my thoughts, mom. Mom, we need to do something about it. We, we need to do something. I mean, it's not ordinary. Uh, you don't have to worry yourself. Your father can handle such situation. All you need to do now is to go to his room this night and make sure you wear something very exposing and sexy. Yes, no matter how strong a man is, he must fall for the power of a woman. Yes. Yes. You are a very beautiful girl. Any man that doesn't find you attractive has a very big problem. Yes. It's all right. It's all right. Oh, <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you for your kind words. You know, you actually remind me of the Queen of My England. Goodness. Shut up. Can't you see I'm on the phone? Thank you so much, Mother. Thank you. I'll do just that. I'm relieved now. You are always welcome. Okay, bye, Mom. Okay. Move so I can see you. Move. What is it? Dinner is served, my princess. Dinner is served, my princess. That is the only thing you know. Food. That's why you look like an octopus. Food. Morning food. Afternoon food. Evening food. That's the only thing you think of. Get your silly self out of here. Sorry, my princess. Baby bouncer. What the hell are you standing there staring at? Huh? Oh, you haven't seen a beautiful princess before, is it? Oh, get the hell out of there. Run along! Shush away! Ew! You're all so dull. Anyways, my mother says I should go into his room tonight looking all sexy. I think that is exactly what I need to do. Go to his room tonight. He still doesn't like her. Yes. I mean, why? This is serious. Very, very serious. More serious than I thought. Uh, uh, please, Igwe. We need to do something very fast. Do something about it. Please. He can't run away from his destiny. Of course. This is the tradition. I must marry my daughter as long as she remains the prince of Umwezemazi kingdom. He must. Yes. 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 No one. No one can do anything about it. You must marry my daughter. Who 
Who's there? Enough, 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 please. Princess Oma, kindly leave my room right now. My prince, for goodness sake, you are going are, to be my husband. Are you still standing here? You're going to be my husband. Prince, I'm... Leave my room. Leave my room. But you can't ask me. I to... said leave my room. No, 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 you don't shout at me. I am not one of your maidens. I am a princess. You would accord me some respect. You will accord yourself some respect and get out of my room before I do something nasty to you. Princess Oma, get out. Get out! Get out! My father was scared this. What nonsense. How did I get... I know you must be wondering why I came back. Well, I came to air my mind. You know what? You are heartless. You are a demon. You're a monster. You are a beast. You know what? I am sick and tired of everything in this palace. I am going back enough of your insults. You heard me. Uchi. Princess Oma. What is going on here? Why don't you ask this little uncultured Silly swine, you call a son. I've had enough of his insults and humiliation. Like I said to him, I am going back to my father's palace where I am being regarded as a princess, a gorgeous princess. Huh? I'm leaving. Are you for real? Yes, he said I should bring her in today. For real? This is a good news. You see, helping this poor girl will open more doors in your family. Amen. Amen. See, she has promised to be coming to the church every day to be helping in sanctuary keeping till she gets a job. Okay. Okay. Let me bring her so that you can start going. But don't forget to send my regards to your husband. Just for helping a total stranger that you know nothing about. More blessing will come to your family. Amen. And I will tell my husband. Okay, family. God bless you. Her name is Adesi. So Adesi. Adesi. The prince uh, say he has spoken to a lot of people about finding her a job. But for the meantime, she'll be going to church every morning for sanctuary keeping. You know, that's to avoid the... Uh, I do. Okay, I okay. That's as You're welcome, man. Eh? Thank welcome. you. Feel at home, man. Eh? Thank you very much, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you, ma, for accepting me to your home. God bless you. Amen. 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 Bless Amen. you too. Amen. Uh, meanwhile, sweetheart, why not then um, try a way to keep her bag and maybe let her freshen up and get her something to eat? Okay, sure, ma'am. Alright. Adele, I have time over. Come on. Thank you, sir. Father, this is enough. I mean, it's enough. I have had enough of his nonsense. I mean, who the hell does he think he is? What effrontery? What, what audacity? What impetus? Mother, I am as much royalty as he is. Why is he acting like I am forcing him to be with me? Why? Uh, please, please, my daughter, calm down. Butu, only. Uh, mother, mother, don't start. Don't even start. Don't ask me to butu. Don't ask me to do it. I will not do it. I won't. 
At this point, I am done. I won't tolerate any more nonsense from him. This is it. Diamond. What you and Prince Uchenna do not understand or do not realize is that as far as both of you are concerned, this marriage must happen. Yes. The only thing that will make this marriage fail is the death of one of you. But you see, as long as both of you are alive, this marriage must hold. See, so there is nothing that can be done about this. The marriage must hold. If I decode to do Berlinam, if you leave it, Otaliam, Ekoyaka, Ekopiam, Olam. There's no running away from it. That's it. Ulumayo. So that you, you, you don't default in any way. Let the fault come from them. It's a tight case. Really? Yeah. Really? Oh, Gods of my ancestors, I am so confused on this very matter now. Where do I start? My son has vowed never to listen to me on this marriage saga. The truth is, he is a grown-up man now. I can only take him to the stream, but I cannot force him to drink the water. I've tried so hard to force Princess Oma on him, but it's not working. All my efforts ended in futility as it stands right now. I don't know what else to do. Get the car ready. Let's rush him to the hospital. And meanwhile, get the priest. Tell the priest what's going on. Your Majesty, please be fast about it. you barge into my room without knocking? My prince, there is trouble. There is big trouble in the palace. What trouble? Igwe just collapsed and has been rushed to the hospital. What happened? What happened to my father? What's going on with the king? How's the king? Please, what's going on with the king? My prince, you have to calm down. I, I, I'm calm. I'm calm, doctor, please. Just, just tell me, how's the king? No, you're not calm. Okay, okay. Doctor, he's calm now. Please, can you tell us the true position of the king? Please. Please, just, just tell us, how's, how's my father? Please, how is he? Okay. You see, your father has been overthinking lately. And I ask myself, what is the problem? What can a king like him, who has everything he wants at his beck and call, be thinking to the extent of developing high blood pressure? Blood pressure. Uh, but is he, is he okay? I mean, you've treated him right. Is, is he better now? No, he is not. 
In fact, he developed a partial stone. But not to worry too much. I believe we can correct that. If he responds to treatment. And um, another thing, you should try and find out what has been eating him up. I, I, I know what it is. I know, I know what's eating him up. You do? I will do something about it. Wow. Okay, better. We really have to do something about it. Because his condition is not advising. We need to do something about it. But he'll be fine, okay? You don't need to worry yourself too much. I'm sure about that. Father, I know that I know that I I have done so many things to wrong you. But I just want you to know that I've never done anything deliberately to hurt you. And I would do anything. I would do whatever it takes to make sure that that you're okay. That you're happy. Because I know that that is what you want for me too. You want my happiness. Father, I, I have tried my best. I've tried my best to accept Princess Oma in my heart. But no matter what I try, no matter how hard I try, there's just something that doesn't accept her. Every time I try to get close to her, something pushes me away. But now that I see that this whole thing is affecting your health, I'm ready to sacrifice. I'm ready to do whatever it takes to make sure that, that you're fine. Because I, I, I can't imagine losing you. So I want to let you know that I accept Princess Oma. I accept her with all my heart. And I will do everything it takes to make the marriage work. I promise I'll never hurt her again. I'm sorry. Charlie, My prince. I need you to arrange two servants. We're visiting the princess. Two? My prince, we can only go with one because two are already with the king at the hospital. That's fine. Get them ready immediately. Okay, ma'am. Hurry up, please. How many times have I made it clear that you smile broadly each time you see me like you have seen the Queen of England? 
What happened a few minutes ago? What? Huh? Keep your mouth shut, octopus. Especially you. There's something about you that is so, so annoying. Now you bark like a dog. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Mm, a husband. bigger dog, I said. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I said, keep barking. Ooh, 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 What's name are you doing here, you arrogant and proud fellow? I said, what are you doing here? My princess, I have come to apologize to you. I am so sorry for causing you pain instead of bringing you joy. I made a lot of mistakes and I have realized my mistakes and I want to promise you that it will never happen again. Stand up. Stand up, stand up. Stand up. I mean, this is, this is utterly beautiful. <laughs> you knelt before me. Oh, my king. Listen, you, you shouldn't do that, okay? You, you shouldn't kneel before me. You are my king. The crown over my head. I mean, you mean everything to me. Uh, and please, I am so sorry. I am deeply sorry for everything I did to you. I, I shouldn't have spoken to you in that manner. I, I was angry. But not anymore. It's okay. You don't need to apologize for anything. I deserve whatever you did to me. Oh my goodness. Because I hurt you. And now that things are different, I hope we can start over again. Did you hear that? What did you say? I said I hope we can start over again. <laughs> oh my goodness! Oh. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. Uh, we, we shouldn't be doing this in public oh. before our subjects were royalty. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's true. I totally forgot. I'm just overly excited. I understand. <laughs> Did you hear that? Smile! Baby octopus. Never mind. <laughs> Let, let's go inside, okay? Keep smiling. Keep smiling. You'll continue barking like a dog. Boom! Oh! <laughs> let's go. <laughs>
The prince has left. And then, your daughter went to see you. She can't contain her. <laughs> ah. When you put the right hand, it's difficult. You put the left hand. If it's difficult, you put both hands. You force it. If I name something must happen. <laughs> ah! Don't tell me it's your handwork. Hey, Apova. Huh? Apova. Apova. Apova is in a canoe. Where is that tribe? Where is that tribe? Listen, go in there and get me the khaki, quickly. Yes, ma'am. Do you want to drive yourself? Yes. I have to do this. I have to drive me alone. No guards, nothing. Just me, the car, and the road. Huh? My husband, how can you, a king, drive yourself in the company of no one to a trip? What would people say if they see you? Tell me. Where is that boy? Let them say whatever they want to say. <sighs> I am driving this car. Me, car, and the road. That's all. Please. Uh, you Where is this boy? My king. My, my, my king, please. You don't have to do this alone. Guidance. See you when I return. My king, please. Please, don't, don't, don't go there alone. See you. When I am back. What he says does. I can't believe what I Ah. <laughs> What do you want? Aqua, Aqua, you are lucky. I want you to send uh, something to my friend Igor Kaka that will make his son turn back begging my daughter. She is all I have. If had right as the princess of this land is denied her, knowing fully well that I do not have another child. What have I gained in killing my brother, his wife and his sons to become king? Hello, 
Oh, they bear, what can you see? Oh, they bear, what can you see? Is the question be real or be real? O botarena, will you run up? You okay? You okay? It's send a minu and one. You okay? Tomorrow morning. Your desire shall be granted. Ready, let's rush him to the hospital. And meanwhile, get the priest. Tell the priest what's going on. Your Majesty, please be fast about it. So it was you after all. What I'm talking about is that the palm wine tapa can never talk about, divulge everything he saw from the palm wine tree. If he does, he will follow it, he will fall. Not for either. Things are happening. I got the one other can can go my juice yaba. Eh? The old woman never gets old. In that dance step, she knows how to step, how to dance. Whenever you hit the tune, no matter how complicated the drumming is, the old woman steps out. And she moves her body. <laughs> no wonder. No wonder everything happened so fast. My mind is at rest. At rest. Mm. It's so nice to see how it all happened immediately. That's so soon. Charlie, 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 what is it, please friend? stop the car. That lady, that lady, I need you to call her for me. You need to call her. 
to get her for me. This one? This one in her. Get her, please. Go and get her. Excuse me. Hello, excuse me. How are That's you? Good up. afternoon. Someone wants to see you. The Prince of Umwezemaza Kingdom, Prince Uche. Your Majesty, my princess. Princess Omar, the ever gorgeous, beautiful Princess Omar, the one you you have come to see. Oh, you? Yes, me. Um, you're welcome. You're welcome to my humble abode, peaceful abode. You are welcome. I see. Um, you see, is that all you have to say? I mean, am I not, um, beautiful enough? <laughs> um, is, is anyone disputing your beauty? Oh, no, of course. No one can dispute that. But, you know, I was expecting you to say more. Like, I am elegant, beautiful. Outstanding, gorgeous. Oh. <laughs> yes. Uh, well, maybe you're just seeing things the wrong way. Um, there's no dispute in the fact that you're beautiful. You are. <laughs> Mother! <laughs> he says that I am beautiful. <laughs> yes. Thank you. Thank you very much, my prince. Thank you. Um, <clears throat> Prince Uche, uh, I am delighted to note that your wife to be has bid you a rousing and warm welcome. Um, it is left for the maids to do their job. Yes. Yes. Let the maids do their job. Serve the prince, and of course, we serve ourselves. You are a graduate of sociology from the prestigious Harvard University. With a distinction, my prince. Don't forget to add. That's interesting. Thank you. Tell me, tell me you don't see anything wrong with this archaic and mundane marriage arrangements. What do you mean by that? In this modern time, after all the exposure you've gotten from studying abroad, are you telling me you don't see anything wrong with this marriage arrangement? You still haven't said anything to my understanding. <laughs> what do you mean? Tell me, apart from pictures, have you ever seen me or met me anywhere in the world before? No. What is this all about? How can two perfect strangers be made to marry each other just because of some stupid and unreasonable ordinance. Oh, uh, now I see where you were coming from. Mm. But I'll tell you this for free, my prince. 
We shouldn't let education and exposure deny us our culture. We should be promoting it instead. This is our heritage. We should uplift it and not castigate it. I see. <laughs> well. So, who was that girl that was ahead of the procession when you came to greet me? Who exactly are you talking about? The maiden. The one that was directly in front of you. Excuse me. Princess. The piece of war. Where? Um, where is the Mazda Kingdom? He's inside that car? Yes, he asked me to call him. How did he see me? Uh, he just saw you right from the car. Uh, yes. Tell him I'm coming. Please come and see him. No, be going. I'll follow you behind. Okay. I'm so good. Where are you running to? Stop it! Charlie, what happened? My prince, I, I don't know. As soon as I told her you wanted to see her, she agreed to follow me. Then the next thing, I thought she wasn't following me only for me to look back and I found out she's running away. Yeah, I, I, I saw that. I wonder why she's running. I wouldn't know, my prince. This is strange. Let's go. Maybe, maybe we'll, maybe we'll meet her again along the road. Why is she running? For be batty. You are looking for you want to put in trouble. I reject you. Now that now that my life is is better, you want to come and destroy it again. I don't even know how they they, they even they was able to see me. Eh? Hey, thank God I was fast enough to escape. Ha! They saw me. Thank God, though. Oh, forbid. Now that I've, I've changed location, you want to come and put me back to square one? Go forbid. Why does it feel as if everything about my being needs her? Why did she run? Now she's supposed to be at Umozome Kingdom. What is she doing here? Gosh, I need answers.
Who is this, sir? What? <laughs> what? Sorry, I've been waiting for you to come back so that I can lock the door. So what? What is going on here? Am I not talking to you, man? I said, what is happening here? No, push me. I was waiting for him to come back so that I can lock the door. Uh -huh. So, what happened? When he came, I, I said I, f I felt... You felt what? Nothing. Oh, don't be stupid. He started touching my leg. Why would this man be touching my leg? She be is blind, he can't he doesn't know that this way leads to his room. Did he have something else? Problem in your house. Please, I'm, I'm sorry. Please, I don't want to cause more problem between you and your husband. Please, I'm sorry for all, all this problem. It was not my intention to cause problem in your home. So, sorry. It's not you. Just stand up. You left man. You come and meet me here. This is total unusual. From princess to palace bedding on the Zimba You have taught her royal court Ibe ya wa mebu A royal nile ho Adeze! 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 Auntie Joy, thank you for everything you did for me. Thank you for bringing me into your house. I am very grateful for the little time I stayed with your family. You were such a nice person. God will bless you. Please, I wouldn't want my stay in your house to bring issues between you and your husband. 
I know you would still want me to stay, but your husband is no longer happy with me. Staying in your house is no longer safe for me. That is why I had to leave. I hope you meet this letter well. Thanks, Adese. This is total unusual. From princess to palace, bedding on the zimba. You have taught a royal court. Ibeya wamebu, a royal nile. Onebe. What should I do now? Should I go back to the Reverend Father? Who will I tell him that sent me out? Hey, what will I tell him that led to the problem? This should be exposing Auntie Joy's husband unnecessarily. I am not sure she will like it. I can't pay her evil after what she did for me. I can't. What do I do now? Eh? What do I do now? Where do I go? Hey. I'm just so confused. I'm just so, so confused. The doctor said you'll be discharged tomorrow. He said you're well enough now. Yes, my son. I am fine now. I'm glad. I'm glad that you feel better now. <sighs> Guess what, father? What? I made up with Princess Oma. Oh. She'll be coming to our palace tomorrow. We'll sit down and start plans towards our wedding. Oh, this is good news. So happy to hear that. Son, yes, I'm so proud of you. Thank you, Father. Now my joy is full. As your joy shall always be full. Yes, uh, I'm proud of you. I'm glad you're okay.
There she is. <laughs> the future queen of Umoeze Maze Kingdom. That's me. Beautiful princess <laughs> of the royal household of Umo Zome. <laughs> you of the lineage of Oranye Dynasty. <laughs> you are welcome. Oh, my prince. <laughs> welcome to my abode where you belong. Thank you so much, my prince. <laughs> Your words gladden my heart. Oh. It melts the innermost part of my being. Am I not lucky? Am I not lucky to have a charming prince like this young man here as my husband to be? I can't wait to be your wife. The future king of Umwezimazi. Most importantly, the king of my heart. Oh. Oh. <laughs> he said, oh. <laughs> Thank you so much, my king. You're welcome. Please come in. <laughs> Sorry. More! Yes, more. <laughs> Thank you. The door. You know, I really can't wait for that day. I can't wait for the D-Day. I mean, this has been my dream since childhood. Just me and you, riding on chariots. The villagers cheering, laughing and being envious of the beautiful love we share. And they will say unto me, here comes the beautiful ever Rogers, queen of Umwezimaze. This has been my dream since childhood. I am so excited. Oh my God. <laughs> it is quite exciting indeed. It is. <laughs> you know, the people of Umozome and Umwezemazi are about to witness the greatest wedding in the history of both kingdoms. Oh, you are so intelligent. <laughs> We're about to make history. Yes, we are. <laughs> oh, you're making me blush. <laughs> Oh my goodness, you know what? Since I'm going to be the future queen of Mwezemazi, don't you think it's only proper for you to take me to the important places in your kingdom? I mean, I want to see everywhere. You took it right out of my mouth because I was about to ask if you would like to take a walk. Oh my God. <laughs> you see, we are meant to be together. I know, right? What I think is what you think. <laughs> <laughs> Shall we? Definitely. All right. <sighs> Shall we? Yes, we shall. Oh. <laughs> Let's go, my friends. Okay. Mm, thank you. So excited to finally show you the Great Omunwa River. Oh my goodness. <laughs> We're almost there. Oh, really? Mm. I am super duper excited. <laughs> you know, it's been my dream to see the Omunwa River the whole time. My father speaks so graciously about it. Well, here we are. Oh, really? Before you right here is the Great Omunwa River, oh. the ancient river of our people. Yes, I know. It's fascinating, isn't it? Where did she take? Adeze! 
I didn't say, why are you running? Why are you running from me? I, I, I don't want to hurt you. I, I just want to talk. Please. I dare say. Why is she running from me? Why is she always running? of what like you did not hear me what was the meaning of that i was here with you and you ran after a common estranged maiden and you asked me what was what huh look princess oma the truth is i need to talk to that girl okay I, I i don't know what it is about her there's something there's something about that girl there's a connection i felt to her from the very first time i met her at your kingdom and ever since then this i, I just don't understand there's something about her. I need to find out who she is the and only why. The thing you do not understand is your personality. You parade yourself as a prince, but let me tell you, you are a princess. You've got no mind of your own. Do you know what? You disgust me. Princess. Hmm? Princess Omar. What is it? I, I can explain. Don't explain anything. It, and don't princess Omar me. It's not what you think. <laughs> <laughs> And bring my shoes. Oma, why? My shoes. Oh. No way. Well, at least now I know her name is a Daisy. Hey. <laughs> I don't know why I'm always running into trouble. What kind of a life is this one? <laughs> Thank God I was not naked when they came with. I'm not going to go to that stream again and go and take my bath. I will not go there again. What am I supposed to do now? Then of my life. Every time I go there, I'm going to see me. You have succeeded. Ruling her life. You made her. I dare say. Walking from place. I dare say. Why did she run? Why did she always run? My princess, please understand what I'm saying. I'm not saying I want to make her my wife or my mistress. The connection I'm talking about is it, it's beyond the physical one. It, it's deeper than flesh and mind. Enough! Enough of that nonsense! I do not want to hear you spit that rubbish to my face again. I mean, for goodness sake, how dare you? How dare you say such about it? Come on, palace made into my hearing. What is wrong with you? Don't you have any out of respect for I me? I do have respect no, for you. No, you don't. I do. Oh, please. 
The respect I have for you has nothing to do with what we're talking about here. It has nothing to do with her. It's the spell. The spell is at work again. What spell? She cast the spell on you. The spell is still very much effective. Look at you. The spell is still at work. What? It's what are still you? very effective. What are you talking about? You need deliverance. Deliverance from what? Love, you need deliverance. The spell needs to be taken off completely. You're not making any sense. Right I now. am making sense. I know what I am saying. She cast the spell on you and it's... No. It's not gone. No, no. I, thought, I thought it was gone. My love, I, you, you need deliverance. It needs to be taken away from you, I swear. This is it. That girl is a witch. I'm telling you, she cast a spell on you because... I don't understand how a fine young man like you will come for a beautiful, outstanding, amazingly, beautifully created maiden like me. And all of a sudden, your focus was all on her. Don't you suspect anything? You know, I thought about this and I asked the palace guard to trail her. And this is it. Boom! There you go. So, where is this exactly? Her coven, of course. Her operational quarters. There. I, I don't believe it. What do you mean you don't believe it? Huh? Do I look like someone who can just fabricate lies like this? That's not what I mean. But... Now what do you mean? What exactly do you mean? Come, come Hello, on. Um, please. Please. You need to listen to all I am saying. Listen. This girl was banished and excommunicated from our kingdom. Because she is a witch. In my kingdom, we don't allow witches mingle with humans. I can't even tell how many lives this girl has taken. You have to believe me. I'll advise you tell your father to send her away. See to it that she's sent out of this kingdom before she causes more havoc here. I'm just trying to save you and the lives of your people. That's how kind and good I am. You have to believe me. There you go, you have to believe me. My love. Oh my goodness. Come here, baby. What is it? Don't you think this is a gift you're supposed to give me on our wedding night? We're royalty. We're not supposed to defile ourselves before our wedding. Oh. I am... Um, I'm sorry. I am... Um, I, I didn't think of it that way. You know, um, I, I like the sound of the wedding. I, I was actually carried away. I just wanted to have a bit of you, you know? Mm. As my husband to be my king. Um, my, 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 oh goodness. I just love the sound of our wedding. I mean, it just gives me this picture in my head. <laughs> yes, that night is going to be superb. Special, right? Very special. <laughs> oh my goodness. But you can hold me, right? Oh, <laughs> please do. <laughs> hold me. Oh my goodness. Oh, I can't believe this. I mean, we're going to have a fairy tale wedding with horses, chariots, and everything. Oh my god. <laughs> and we're going to have beautiful kids. Cool, beautiful kids. They're going to have your nose. <laughs> oh, hold me closely.
I laugh. <gasps> You're not sleeping. Wait a minute. Don't, don't tell me you're thinking about that, that girl. Thinking about what? Who? What do you mean what? What do you mean who? You don't know who I am talking about? For goodness sake, a woman who is going to be your wife is lying right beside you. And you are here thinking about a common policy maiden. You know what? You disgust me. Go. I think I'm gonna beg you. What did you say? You? I heard your voice. I heard you. Why? Sorry. I'm oh, sorry for your little self. Hmm. What are exactly what I am saying? That's what I'm saying. We were having fun. We were talking, gisting, laughing, and then we decided to go on a walk. Exactly, mother. And then that witch just appeared from nowhere. I don't, I don't even know how she knew where we were. You know, she just has a way of finding her way in places that they didn't invite her to. What? Yes, she was at a stream. You mean what you're telling me now? Mother, he ran after her. He left me there and ran after her. Mother, can you believe that? Yes, mother, yes. Okay, okay. It's all right. Yes, he is here with me. Yes. Mom, mom, listen. You need to talk to dad. You need to tell him that that witch has resurfaced and that my wars has begun again. I'm telling you, mother, you need to do something. What did she say? What do we call this one again? Eh? That witch of your niece is roaming about Umezema's kingdom. Deze. Who else? What happened? Your daughter said. They have been happy together since she arrived at the palace. Playing and catching fun with her husband-to-be. That things took a different turn when they decided to take a walk around the village and saw Adeze. Immediately they saw Adeze, Prince lost his mind again. <clears throat> that he even left her and ran after Adeze. From that moment, he has been thinking about Adeze. And that he has gone back to his hostile way of treatment to our daughter. What do you mean by Please, please, your majesty, don't say this. Don't do this. Eh? Are, are you going to say only, hmm? Is it not you again? Can't you do something about it? Please, you have to complete what you've started. Let us settle this matter once and for all so that everyone can rest. Please, do something, please. You just have to do something and do it very fast. I'm not finding it funny again. This is getting out of hand. Huh. It's me. I'm Prince Nchi. Yes, father. I thought you said you were willing to sacrifice your self-will to keep me alive and healthy. 
Yes, I did. Why is your queen leaving the palace and threatening never to return? She's what? The last time I spoke to him on the phone, he said in Sati Konyamara, he's closed my princess. <laughs> Wait a minute. The driver actually wants to keep the princess waiting? Really? You know what? <laughs> my love. Who is your love? Huh? Who is your love? Your love is at Umumwa River. Go there and meet her there. That's where she is. My love, please. Listen, I have thought about everything you have said. And I've come to the realization that you're right. Mm. I have been under a spell. A very, very big spell. But my eyes are open now and I can see clearly. And I want to promise you that I will do everything in my power to make you happy. I promise I will never think about her again. I promise. Pickle. Wait a minute. You promise? I promise. With everything that is in my heart. Please, don't leave me in anger. Please, let's go back inside so we can sit and plan our wedding. It's just in two weeks. Really? Come here! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, this is so great. Yeah, okay, it's fine. Let, let, let's go inside. Okay. Smile! Smile! <laughs> You mean she left your house since and you did not tell me? Father, I thought she came back to the church. I've searched for her several in the mass, but you didn't see her before you called. I have not been seeing her in the masses and she has stopped coming to the sanctuary clinic. But I used to see you and your husband steady. That is why I decided to ask. Father, she left to me. I woke up one morning, calling and searching for her. I didn't know she has left. I left a, a, a written note that she left on the table before leaving. And what was her reason for leaving? But that's a long story. A long story. Yes, Father. But where could she be now? Father, only God knows you. But you should you people should have told me. I am regretting letting my niece leave. I ought to have killed her the time I killed her parents, but I let her leave. Now I am seeing that it was a great mistake. What do you want me to do? Um, I want to go back to what the plan was initially. I want to do away with her. I want her dead. Ubo is the question and I won your own. Eh? Won your own? Hmm. 
No death spell can work on her. Huh? Why? She has an altar where she communicates with the dead. A place where she communicates with her dead parents. Uh, I know about the altar. What about it? Any death spell you send to her must boomerang back to you. There must be a way. There must be a way out of this. Ibaba, Ine, Ibaba, Ine. Nene kweki ole kirire, obona tobona eki warwa. Nene kweki ole kirire, obona tobona eki warwa. Eh? Miroke. Okay, Miroke. Esame Miroke. I will send a death logo to her. As long as she bears the mark, anybody that sees her will feel an urge to kill her. Once the person succeeds in killing her, the person will free from the urge. But then, he will regret his actions. But then, the deed must have been done. <laughs> what do you think about this? No, I don't like this. What? Mm -mm. Don't worry. Let me send it to you. This is a beautiful gold piece. How don't you like it? No, don't worry. I prefer this. Really? Yes. Mm -hmm. You... Oh, you realize it is my day. Yes, this I is know. a special day. I mean, it's a one-in-a-lifetime thing. I just want the prince to see me and fall in love with me. I understand. You know, I, I actually thought this was going to suit better. No. No. This tells more of royalty than this. Mm. Put it on first. Put it on. You sure? I am sure. Look at it! Perfect! You sure? Yes! <laughs> you look so beautiful. Oh, Mom. Oh. You know you're very good in making good choices. Yeah. And whatever you say, mm, it is fine by me. Now, let's go for a matching earring, right? A matching earring. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, I love this. This actually looks like a cage <laughs> to hold him. Catch him down! <laughs> I'm going to book him.
Who are you? Um, my name is Adeze. I, I came from. No, I, I'm looking for a work. I want to work. I'm looking for a job. Anything at all. You. Yes. It is you. Yes. No. It's I'm, you. Me, I don't understand. I don't get what. You I'm think doing. I will recognize you? I recognize you now. Yes. It's you. It's you. Madam, please, what's the meaning of this? Why are you, are you romancing me or holding me? Yeah, hey, romancing you. Madam, I don't understand. No, you will know. Madam, I don't understand what you are saying. Stop now, please. I came here to come for you. You came to look. You get the job. Give me the job. Let don't me worry now. now. Keep quiet. Which one is I should keep quiet? What is it? Madam, let me go now. Ah! Ah, this is no longer. Madam, you are matching me. Hello? You are matching me. Hello, Adibo? Yes. Madam. Yes. You know that girl that came to my shop the other day and stole all the phones? Yes. Madam, leave me now. What kind of thing is this one now? Yes. No, she cannot escape now. Yes. Madam, free me. Free me. She, she cannot me. escape. Madam, I, I, no, 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 I'm with her. You. Just come here. You think I will not recognize Madam, stop this, this, is this is the bag. Stop this is the bag. You are not going anywhere. Stop this nonsense. Yeah. What is all this? You need the camera has come. Anywhere. But I've done this to you. Okay, blow. Keep blowing. Keep blowing. You Your day has come. You want to look for your job. Yes. What you have? Chaser. Get up. Keep up! Where's her? They could not leave her on a try! Kill her! Eat your... See this bag! If not come back, we not come collect the bag! Light up, light up. Where the light up now? You look at light up. Oh, this way. Yeah. Now, you know, go we'll find light up now. You look from here. I say, where they come, find your way. Find your way from here. You will come. Now, you will come. Right, go find your way. Somebody, please help! You know her. Help, help, help! It's her. It's her. We need to help her. We need to help her. It's the maiden I've been looking for. What happened to her? Who did Son, this to her? What do you think you're doing? Can't you see we are late already? Father, I, I, I need to help this lady. I can't leave her here like this. This is a common criminal. Let us hand her over to the police and continue with our journey. No, 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 Father. She's not a criminal. 
I've been looking for her for a long time now. Now that I've seen her, I can't just leave her here like this, please. I beg your pardon? Do you know this lady? Father, Do you know her? Yes, father. She's the lady from Umo's only kingdom. The one I met there. Please, father. We need to help her, please. We need to get her to the hospital. Please, come and help! Are not here yet. It is strange for us. We haven't seen them. Igwe Okaka informed me that they had left their place and we are actually on the way. They ought to be here since. Of he has not been picking his calls. He's not picking. Everybody is waiting out the feed. People are waiting. What is keeping them? I am telling you that the marriage is not holding a kid. And you think I am joking? Nkechi. Nkechi. Mm -hmm. How can you say a thing like that? Look at the time. The, the musician are tired of playing his money. The people are tired, leaving the field one after the other. Nobody has seen the prince of Umu Zemazi. And his people. Uh, I heard they're supposed to come to the palace before moving down to the field. Okay. Oh. Let's go and see if they are at the Igwe Palace. But I guess they are not. But you know, time is not friendly at all. Mm. Okay. It was good. is going to take place. Are you sure he's not he's not going to abandon me today, mother? I as for the wedding. The wedding must hold. Yes. You don't have to worry yourself about that. Are you sure? Yes, yes. She can't afford to disappoint. Oh, yes. Not today. <laughs> this marriage must go. Mama, yes. it's so hard to rock. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh. 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 Oh.
Igwe, yes. What's chasing you? Um, Prince Uche is in the palace. He's here right now. Ah, <laughs> <sighs> our gods are indeed benevolent. Um, Your Highness. Yes. He didn't come with his people. He came alone. Huh? What I say? No, ma. Are you saying that Igwe Okaka did not accompany his son, Prince Uche, to this palace? Exactly. Prince of Umezemaze is here. Here? <gasps> yes. What? He's here. Okay. Here? 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 Here in the palace? Yes, my princess, <gasps> but there's a problem. Problem? What? What? Um, Snake! He didn't come with his people. Why? Oh, uh, uh, excuse me, what nonsense oh, are you talking about? Yeah, he, he actually came alone. You? He came alone. <laughs> with this, this mitzwit, this daughter of a nobody. For years now, you have deceived the good people of Umozome. Huh? Yes. What's he talking about? For years now, the murderer of the good king of this land, Igwe Oraye and his wife, have sat on the throne of this land. What's he talking about? For years now, this imposter, in the name of being a princess, has paraded herself in Umozome, while the real princess was being treated as a slave. What is the meaning of that nonsense? Listen, you are in my father's compound. Yes. You mind your language. Hmm. Um, prince Uchi. My in-law. Please, if you have something to tell us, come out as a man and say it directly. Oh no. Right now, you're speaking in parable. Ah, riddles! This man here. This wicked man here. What? Killed your Igwe. Igwe Oraye and his wife. What? And he also made sure that all his male children died at birth. What? All because of his personal agenda to become king on the land and install this charlatan here as the princess. What is he talking about? Who are you? Um, my name is Adeze. I, I came from. No, I, I'm looking for a work. I want to work. I'm looking for a job. Anything at all. You? Yes. It is you. Yes. No. It's I'm, you. Me? I don't understand. I don't get what you You think I will recognize you? I recognize you now. Yes. It's you. It's you. Madam, please, what's the meaning of this? Why are you, are you romancing me or holding me? Yeah, hey, romancing you. 
Madam, I don't understand. No, you will know. Madam, I don't understand what you are saying. Stop now, please. I came here to come for the you job. You came to look. You get the job. Give me the job. Let don't me worry now. now. Keep quiet. Which one is I should keep quiet? What is it? Madam, let me go now. Ah! Ah, this is no longer. Madam, you are matching me. Oh. Hello? You are matching me. Hello, Aj Ajibo? Yes. Madam. Yes. You know that girl that came to my shop the other day and stole all the phones? Yes. Madam, leave me now. What kind of thing is this one now? Yes. No, she cannot escape now. Yes. Madam, feel me. Feel me. She, she cannot me. escape. Madam, I, I, no, no, I'm with her. You. Just come here. You think I will not recognize this? This is the bag. This is the bag. You are holding the other day. Madam, stop it. You are not going anywhere. Stop all this nonsense. What is all this? The camera has come. Madam, leave me alone now. Madam, what is wrong with you? You are not going anywhere. Madam, stop this nonsense. Hey, okay, blow. I will blow. Keep blowing. Keep blowing. What blow? Then I will. Your day has come. You want to look for your job? Please help! 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 It's her. It's her. We need to help her. We need to help her. It's the maiden I've been looking for. What happened to her? Who did this to her? What do you think you're doing? Can't you see we are late already? Father, I, I, I need to help this lady. I can't leave her here like this. This is a common criminal. Let us hand her over to the police and continue with our journey. No, 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 Father. She's not a criminal. I've been looking for her for a long time now. Now that I've seen her, I can't just leave her here like this, please. I beg your pardon? Do you know this lady? Do you know her? Yes, Father. She's the lady from Umozone Kingdom. The one I met there. Please, Father. We need to help her, please. We need to get her to the hospital. Please, come and help! Come here, come and... Wait. Help me get out. Okay. 
Okay. Are you are you all right? You know me. You recognize me. Yes. Who are you? What are you doing here? How did you end up like this? My name is Adeze. Yes, I know that much. I know you are Adeze. But the other time I met you at Umozome Kingdom. So what are you doing in this kingdom and how did you end up like this? I have always been a victim of circumstance. I am Adeze, the legitimate daughter of late King Oranye. The king, the late king of Umuzume kingdom, who was unjustly killed by his brother so he can take over the throne. What did you just say? Igwe, I was there when he snuffed life out of my father. That... They, they, it didn't end there. They went ahead to kill my mother a month later. And I have been a slave in my father's own palace. My war started when your son, the prince, came to seek their daughter Omar's hand in marriage. Instead of falling in love with Omar that he came to look for, he, he left and started liking me. This brought a lot of trouble to me because they decided to, to banish me by lying that I was a witch. They accused me of witchcraft and sorcery. I am innocent, Your Highness. Wait, can you confirm all the stories? with an oath in the presence of a strong deity. Can you do it? Uh, yes. Even now I can, Your Highness. Ochako, Your Majesty, call back the entourage. The Ogene boys, the masquerade dancers, and even the women group. This marriage is cancelled as far as I am concerned. We must get to the root of this matter. Take me back to the palace. Clean this maiden up and take her to the hospital. Father, Father, can you permit me to handle this my own way? I'll take her with me and make sure that I deal with this my own way. Please, Father. Very well then. Make sure that the maiden is safe. She's safe with me. I promise you. Trust me. She's safe. Please. Not realizing that because royalty acknowledges royalty, her presence irritated me right from the start. What? Ah. And all along, the real princess is her. Hmm. This is the person I should be getting married to here today. They have tried their best to make that impossible. But in spite of everything, destiny has brought us together. What is it? No. Black. Black and black. Yes. It's not anything. He is lying. Get up. You 
You have tried everything to keep us apart, but destiny brought us together in spite of it. Oh. How can you have such obscenities here? Yes. How can you? How? Yes. How? You can't deny it. You can't. You know the truth. And your wife as well knows the truth. You lie! You lie! It's a me. It's a me. Okay, Terry. Okay, Terry. Okay, Terry. What's your mother wear? What's your mother wear? It's a me. It's a me. Biko. Biko. What's your mother wear? What's your mother wear? Oh, yeah. What's your mother I want your brother. I want your brother. He wouldn't listen. He said that your brother will be upon him and his children's children. He will please. He will please. here and seek justice for Daisy. It is a lie. A big lie. Yes. He's not telling the truth. He's not. He's not. Look, are you listening to him? Are you? Look at this boy looking at me like that. Igwe. What do you want to do? Can you swear with the sacred feather of truth and justice that what this young man is saying here are all lies? Igwe, please swear. Clear your name and save the kingdom this embarrassment. Oh, no. No. Save us this shit. Swear, Igwe. Clear your name. Swear. Swear. No! Do I consider it fierce doing accusation? No. Swear! You don't have to swear, you've already told them to go swear. It's your kid. Okay! It's okay! 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 I will swear! No! I will swear! Swear! Yes, I will swear! I will swear! I will swear! I will swear! Yes, no. I will swear! No. I will swear! Thank <laughs> you. 